Good evening and welcome to Connor John's News and Views. I'm here at NASA's Jet Propulsion Lab in California for an exclusive interview with Professor Hooligan Pink Pants of Seastone. He's an engineer working on NASA's latest rover, Affinity, due to be launched in the next few weeks on a mission to seek out the suspected colony of cat size is the life forms beneath the surface surface of Mars, recently picked up by Curiosity Rover's thermal emission imaging system. Good morning, Professor. I see you're working hard, and I understand that this mission is running to a tight schedule. Greetings, alien. Get it? <laughs> you're British, so you're an alien this side of the big pond. Um, yes. Well, Professor, is this the rover you're working on here? This, it sure is. This here is Triple A, the, the anthropological ambassador. He's going to go up there and make friends with our Martian buddies. Compared with previous rovers, he's incredibly small. Can you please explain why? Well, you see, he's got to get down through some pretty small tunnels to find the little green fellas. And, of course, we wanted him to seem friendly, else we could have a diplomatic disaster on our hands. You seem quite sure there are aliens up there. But some say that the data received from Curiosity last month was down to some sort of malfunction. Baloney! Some say that the Affinity Rover's mission is to prove that there are no aliens on Mars and to restore public order. Baloney! All of our Mars missions have been leading to this moment. We've suspected for decades that these guys were up there. Respectable scientists like us in Seastone, look at the evidence. Right now, the evidence is that Mars is populated. There has been some mass panic since information about the data was leaked last month. There's even the suggestion that you planted this data to become famous. Are you for real? I'm a serious scientist. Is this a NASA conspiracy to cure? Claw back the funding over the budget cuts over the last couple of Get days. out of my lap! Security! Well, that's it for this evening, folks. This is Connor John reporting on the NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory in California. More on this story at the same time tomorrow. If I still have a job, please don't 